Welcome to day three, K2022. The circular economy is another important theme here at the K Show. The avoidance of waste and the use of resources is an important part of plastics. Making sure that that regrind gets put back into the production scheme is an important element. What is Whitman demonstrating on the circular economy here at our booth? For that, I'd like to introduce Dennis Mitral. Hi, Sonny. Good to be with you on the booth. We exhibit uh, on the booth the new product, the S-Max 1. It's a screenless technology with one cutter, uh, high torque, 27 rotation per minute. And it's especially uh, designed to grind uh, hard and brittle material, glass filling material, nylon, PA6. And we also uh, have on our range or on our portfolio, the Junior Double. It's uh, the same technology, screenless, but with double rotor to be efficient for granulation in a central location. We also exhibit blade granulators for soft material. We will be very happy to receive uh, customers, visitors on the booth. Safe travel to Germany and uh, we will wait and expect your visits. Besides the standalone or besides the press applications, we also have a complete solution on display in the VDMA Circular Economy Forum. Let's go there now. Hello, Christian. What makes this EcoPower 110 applicable to the circular economy? This EcoPower 110 with a 35 millimeter screw is a fully integrated working cell and integrated is also a granulator with a perfect footprint. So because it's integrated into the insider, the product is a bio block. It's a toy for children and it is made out of fasal, which is a biomaterial. The composite of this material is a uh, wood powder uh, together with a uh, post-industrial uh, polypropylene and uh, the product is uh, made out of an uh, eight cavity mold. So can you explain the process? The products including the runners are uh, removed by a Whitman robot W918 and will transfer the sprue into a uh, granulator the S-Max 2. And after that, the products will be right transferred to a full fill seal system and afterwards packaged. The quality insurance will be done by our high Q flow, well known already, and uh, with our brand new high Q melt premium that helps the customer or the operator to uh, see the melt flow index. So, high Q melt premium calculates the melt flow index. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Typically, the operator has no idea about the melt flow of the material or material batch. And he doesn't know if there are any changes in the behavior of the material during production. The control system B8 calculates a melt flow index and is comparing a reference value from the material supplier. So it can also improve quality for the user. Not only the quality, it also improves the production effectiveness. And in the end, the operator's burden is lost and you have in the end more money in your wallet. Awesome. Thanks, Christian. So if recyclates are being used in a process and regrind is creating a lot of dust, Whitman also has a solution for a dedusting system. So don't forget to come see us and it's, it's all, all Whitman. Whitman.